literally about 80 percent prior oh, answer yeah. which is a little bit so here we go this is the winner side for top eight yep winner semis uh white boy going up against vendetta so, both with their respective mains yeah exactly now get used to the uh thing there Go, goes for the ice air, right. reloads, get those fire arrows ready. He knows he's gonna have the life lead, and this is his time to sit back and just zone him out. Definitely, especially with the with the advantage with the knockback from the fire arrows, can't keep him away. Exactly, and this is all Green Arrow has to do. But uh, White Boy has lead. a lot of issues. Definitely. This, what are, what are you gonna do against this? Yeah, you basically just gonna have to like you gotta teleport to get in, but then again, like Green Arrow can punish that very well. And he's gonna build all the mirror the moment that Scarecrow gets on Green Arrow. He'll push block, at the very least. Yep. Has a safe wake up with this little fidget spinner. <laughs> that we're calling it the fidget I'm spinner? I'm totally calling it the fidget spinner. The fact that no one else on professional commentary has called it the fidget spinner actually <laughs> is is actually absurd. Oh yeah, of course. So great uh, first life bar by Vendetta there. Yeah, but with this is the scary part. Damage, though, yeah, Scarecrow in the corner is just that. Very, very scary. Oh, oh and the sky here. alert. I respect it. Okay, and now Scarecrow's in the corner, so... With that's literally up. that. That's a moral victory in itself. Even if he loses that life bar, he has all this space to work back. He's just gonna start building some meter. Oh yeah, definitely. But wait for White Boy to make his own mistake. And this looks incredibly this looks difficult. difficult. Yeah. Teleport. Okay. Down one. Nope. <gasps> that Ow. was a huge input error by Vendetta. Yep. He had the boxing glove for the bar of meter and actually loaded up fire arrows, so that bar was wasted. Oh, armor's the armor, and he with the unclassable damage. And, and that, that does it. it. So Vendetta up 1-0, okay. and White Boy refuses to play this matchup. So, that was uh, White Boy going right to Aquaman, or is he... Uh, 100%. Up? Oh, he's going to stick with it. He's going to run it back. Okay. He is the champ. Okay. Yeah, he's going to stick with his guns, you know? I mean, he's obviously came back from worse matchups before. Oh, yeah, CEO, definitely. he went pretty much all Scarecrow mm -hmm. with the exception of one game. Not even a set, yeah, one game. He played he Aquaman, right? I believe it was Aquaman. To my knowledge. Yeah. Uh, maybe someone in the chat could correct me if I'm wrong. So, running it back. There you go. The Savage Blast away. I mean, what else are you really going to do here? Yeah, but yeah, is definitely playing this matchup how I would expect to play. Like, he's going to keep him away. And the Ice Arrow into the fire. Oh, he's going for the Swag combos with the Electric Arrows. I think he's keeping it because the electric arrow arrows help him get uh, uh, meterless damage. Okay. Pretty much off the 2 2 3 guarantees a back three. But here, here, this is the zoning we were telling. This is really what gives White Boy the most problems because White Boy, when he wants to go in, he's going to use that 4 1 or he's going to jump. Green Arrow shuts down all of those options from this range. Especially with the fire arrows, which are going to knock him back almost full yeah. screen. Oh. Not to mention, me and Vendetta are training partners. So Vendetta, he's not new to this matchup. He's played this a oh, few yeah. times. My Scarecrow, not on White Boy's level in the slightest. Plus oh. But the idea is there. Wow, like no use. music for you. Great use of the meter burn uh, interactable. But, oh, again, first life part of Vendetta. He's playing probably just about as perfect as you'd expect. I mean, this is really... And, I, you could tell White Boy's getting a little frustrated, but this is how you have to play the matchup if you're yep. Vendetta. Reset. Doesn't get anything off it, though. No, but with the Electric Arrows, uh, plus enough on hit to really guarantee a little bit of a mix-up. At least some pressure. Okay. Nice forward two push. But like we said, that Savage Blast going to take care of everything from that range. Oh, wait. Good clap. Next. I, didn't see, I actually didn't get a look at the uh, meters, so I would assume White Boy a bit. At this point, even if Vendetta had the meter lead, he's really just going to tie. Oh, yeah. He gets meters so easily, going to use all the kegs. Those are plus on block. Overhead arrow. Wow, just holding it all the way. A little bit of disrespect there on Vendetta's part, but hey, White Boy is now the CEO champion. We all want our turn exactly. taking him down because it just makes us feel better. We, it's his turn to be the bully. And he is the two-time defending champ, too, not for... Even, so. yeah, at versus CEO completely excluded. White Boy has been killing everyone. Yep. Okay, so White Boy has a lot of ground to work on, but he got the meter lead. Mm -hmm. And uh, he's got the green air in the corner right where he wants him. So, okay, here's This the is damage. trouble. Yep. Okay. That's right. Oh, he just eats it. And he eats the back three in the back three. Vendetta of 2-0 on the verge of 3 0 in White Boy. But with yep. White Boy, he's going to stay true to Scarecrow. This is what it's... I mean, even if this is an incredibly hard matchup... This is how you learn. You would rather learn here yep. than go up against a Green Arrow at Evo and get mopped. Exactly. But you can already tell White Boy is starting to get the hang of it. He's being a little bit more patient in that footsie range because he knows once he gets Vendetta in the corner, beautiful armor break. 
Once he gets Vendetta in that corner, that's, that's when the starts. magic happens. Yes. But this mid screen is incredibly difficult. Oh my gosh, and that back three just reaches so far. And he picks up the air tech. So, okay. Good blocks by White Boy. And wow, again. he's spending all the resources. Yep. Like you said, though, he built it up so quickly, though, that he can. But with me, when, when White Boy has the momentum like this, if I was in Vendetta's shoes, I'd be holding onto a bar for push block because no doubt that is the easiest way to get out of Scarecrow's yep. mind games. So, and again, though. Oh, freeze the up arrow. There you go. Yeah, he's back in the corner, though. Cross the combo by oh, White wake up, fidget spinner, switches positions. I like it. Yep. Again, oh. the new Scarecrow wake up. You gotta love it, man. Don't you love it? Scarecrow gets that wake up, and, and then White Boy wins CEO. Yep, Sick. love it. All right, so. Vendetta not out of it just yet. Yep, so sells his clash, uh, even on meter, or he does have the meter lead. But with this, he's going to keep that distance as much as possible. Yep. Oh, low overhead, got to watch out for that. There you go, and this is the part where he starts frustrating White Boy into making bad decisions. Good back dash, okay. Dash forward in the tick grab, okay. Second White Boy's officially in there. Wow, I'm surprised that didn't combo. And there it is, okay. All right, so White Boy's on the screen. And we're running it back. There we go, Vendetta's still up, 2-1. This is winner semis to get into winner's finals. Vendetta, no doubt going to try and go for more of the zoning option. He tried to get a little bit more uh, aggressive there and clearly did not work out in his favor. White Boy using the trade, I think, for only like the first or second time, so. Wake up, Fidget Spinner. Yeah, Clean please. jump in. No bar to really convert for the big damage, so he cancels it to keep him standing. Very smart. Good block on the ice arrow. White Boy's getting very acclimated to those mix-ups. He's been blocking pretty much everything except that uh, meter burn slide. Yeah. Okay, and he takes takes life for very convincingly as well. Apparently, White Boy just decided to wake up real quick. Okay. Definitely trying to get a little more wildlife out of the trade here. Just got to get close, though. Fire Maybe. is definitely going to be tough to do it. You know, forcing White Boy off of that meter. Vendetta's sitting in a much better position. I like the use of the, the instant air fear toxin. Keep himself in the air to kind of stay away from those barrels. And here we go, big damage. He goes to the air tech instead. Not a smart idea. Eats all this damage. And he's gonna have traumatized. Oh, it's gonna be, he should have traumatized. Yep, he does get it. But this is good for Vendetta because now Vendetta has the combo going, and White Boy doesn't do any tick damage when traumatized is available. Yep. So activate the trade. He's gonna chip away, but. Goodbye, uh, Vendetta. To go well, back. White Boy on the verge, taking us to our first game five of the evening. Mm -hmm. You know, just taking a step back. Yep. White Boy, very nice with the patience, going in very quickly. Yep. Very smart not to. That's it. The, the tick damage yep. is going to do it, and we are on the verge of a reverse 3 0. Yeah. Are we going to see the uh, the Batman, or do you think uh, he runs it back? That's a good question because Batman does incredibly well against Scarecrow. But he's going to stick with Green Arrow. Okay. Knowing that White Boy did well against Frederick King at yep. CEO, Definitely. maybe B Batman's not the right idea because let's be serious here. Yeah. Frederick King has the best Batman right oh, now. Yeah, That's pretty, pretty obvious. Very nice blocks by White Boy again. That's really one of the big deciding factors between the beginning of the set and now is just his ability to kind of see those mix-ups and be able to react in time because mm -hmm. he was eating a lot of those overhead arrows from the beginning oh, yeah, definitely but i mean um, great stuff by Vendetta. wow right now like he's just keeping around he keeps loading the fire arrows you know he, now he, he's getting a little bit antsy trying to go in yep. but the zoning is what's really helping 100%. and look at this massive life lead i think he's, he hit him once with like the jumping two no that's okay, it there you go so catches the air tech oh but he missed the uh and there's a Wake Up Savage Blast. Wake Up Savage Blast is not real. There is no invincibility frames, but due to the distance that he travels. Oh, that is a huge punish on the teleport. Does he get the background bounce? Doesn't go. He just goes for the setup on the air. He's keeping it simple because he wants to zone him out. Yep. He has an insane life lead. Yep. This is going to be very tough for White Boy to overcome, but only a true master. He's been through plenty okay. of tough situations, and he has Vendetta now in the corner. Oh, he's... Stops the fidget spinner. And he air techs again. The two bars are gone. Both players almost on the same uh, meter advantage. Yep. Oh, eats the forward two string. And he's at full screen. That's right where Vendetta wants white boy too. Well, the jump two does does catch him. 
air toxin to uh, avoid the arrow. Oh, and on the verge of being chipped out, and, and there it go down two or down one, excuse me, taking out uh, the teleport. And yes. White Boy now sent the losers by Vendetta. First time, first time White Boy's been there. You know, white, white Boy's not happy. No, nah, he doesn't look he's, easy. He's a little yeah. upset. And Vendetta's like, hold on, I gotta go uh, say something in, tra in chat, chat real quick. We, nah, mate, we'll see. Uh, we don't know. Uh, he's a, he's came, he, no, White Boy's come back from losers before. Yeah. He's, it's happened before. All right, I'm gonna go play oh, Dag. Okay. Um, you can get a, uh, see if Nick wants to comment, say he can hop back in.